What's up, you guys? I'm Laconia. I'm Lucille. Welcome to our channel, The Best in You. Yes. So today we're going to be reviewing a um, su subscription service that I started a few months back. Mm -hmm. um, obviously not sponsored. We just started this YouTube channel, but I just got a package in the mail and I thought, why don't we do a video unboxing this and trying out these different snacks from around the world. Mm -hmm. So we're going to find out just shortly. This is through Snack Crate. I hope you can see that. Um, I'm going to open it up and see what country we have snacks from. So are we ready? We're ready. Okay. And... Canada! Oh, Ooh. Canada! Yay! All right. So, Our neighbors to the no north. Yes. So, if you've never seen a Good eye, Mike. snack crate before, let me just show you what it looks like inside. This is what it looks like inside. And look, will you take that package off? Okay, sure. so that tells you all the snacks that are inside. Mm -hmm. So, I'm about to we'll take off this and we will try some of these snacks out. Yeah. So. Okay, I think that's that's good enough. So we can kind of read it off okay. while we are doing it. Juicy I... squirts. Okay. So the first thing oh. that I see here, and then you can just. So the first thing is Ruffles. Ruffles All Dress, the most popular chip in Canada, made with paprika and a sweet blend of spice spices. Mm, okay. All right. So the flavor is all dressed. Yeah, it's called all dressed. Hmm. Yeah. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. That's different. Mm hmm Yeah, that's not bad at all. Mm hmm Hmm. I think that's a keeper. Mm hmm I like this one. It's pretty good. The the red bell pepper. Yeah, it tastes good. Alright, so next we're gonna do another chip called Old Dutch uh ketchup. <laughs> what is All this Dutch. thing about Canada and ketchup? Yeah. Okay. This is the second time I've heard about a ketchup flavored uh, snack from Canada. Oh. I think it does say that it's something about it being it's a popular mm. Alright, so let's try it. Mm, it's definitely coated. Mmm. Mmm. A friend of mine actually actually um, introduced me to having putting a Dipping little ketchup. potato chips and ketchup. Yeah, yeah. Mm. Now this ketchup is kind of vinegary, very tangy. Mm. I don't know how many I could eat of those. Yeah, it's not one that I would. I don't know. It's it's okay, but. Mm. Mm. Mm, right. Mm. You want to go to something sweet or you want to stick to something savory? Um, we need something to get this taste out of our mouth. Yeah, do you want to try the drink? Yeah. Okay. Mmm. Okay, so. Oh, this is very cool. Now, this is my favorite brand of soda, which I don't even drink sodas normally. But I do love a strawberry crush. Now, I don't know what flavor of crush. <laughs> So yeah, this, this is this isn't gonna be strawberry. Oh, it says cream soda, crush, cream soda. Oh wow! Canadian riff on cream soda features the flavors of orange mm -hmm. and French vanilla blended together for a taste that is smooth and sweet. All right, so we have some cups here with a little bit of ice. Um, you want me to pour? I mean, you're drinking the water out of here. Okay. Well, water tends to, you know, change Ooh, the flavor. It's like pink. Mm hmm. Just like the can. Yeah. I wonder why it's pink when it's orange and vanilla. Yeah, I think that's a very interesting color choice. Can you taste the orange? Well, first of all, the smell is a little chemically or. 
Okay, so this tastes to me like cream soda at first, but then it starts to taste like raspberry. Oh, does it? Yep. Mm, yeah, that was, that was, that's okay. It's like a bland raspberry. <laughs> yeah, it's okay. Okay, so next up we're going to go to, I guess, the Ringolos. Oh, Ringolos, Ringolos Barbecue. Crunchy rings made from corn and infused with savory and smoky barbecue flavor. Mm. No, I like different kind of chips and stuff. Uh, I may like these. I yeah. like different kind of things. Yeah. I'm a Lay's regular potato chips kind of girl. Yeah, plain. It doesn't look like I expect it. Mm. Mm -hmm. It's more in the texture of a um, cracker than a chip. Yeah. Kind of thick. Mm -hmm. They're good though. I like them. I don't taste barbecue. Just taste the seasoning. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> like mm. like um, Lowry's. <laughs> Thumbs up or what would you say? Feel free to enjoy those yourself. Yeah, I will. I will, I will. Okay. Mm. Now we have a pastry. Mmm, mm, pastry. Yeah. Which one? Super Passion Flaky. Mmm. Pum from... This light and sweet... I like to read the, the, the um, descriptions yeah. Yeah. to see if what it comes out as Is tastes sweet. like what it says. Yeah. This light and sweet Canadian favorite features flaky pastry filled with fruit, fruity jelly, and cream. Okay, so it's only one. You can split it in half. So you want to just take... Oh, okay. It's like puff pastry. Okay. Well, it's, that's, it's, you only have a little... You know, okay. has like puff pastry. And some kind of... Cream. Yeah. Let's see. I mean, the pastry is, is flaky. It's like they said, but um, yeah, it tastes a little too processed to me. I don't really taste any fruit. It just tastes like sugar. Hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Thanks. Yeah. Okay. So on to the next. Mm -hmm. I have a little water. Mm. Okay. All right. If you're from Canada, let us know if these are the snacks mm -hmm. are actual snacks that you guys eat over there. And whether you really like them. Like that thing right there. Mm -hmm. Passion Flaky. Okay. okay. So next, something that I know my sister's going to love, well, in theory, um, these are called Maynard's Juicy Squirts. Oh, these are, the, juicy, these are the juicy Squirts. Juicy Squirts. These soft and snackable gummies are filled with a sweet splash of fruit flavor in every bite. All righty. Get your juice squirt. So I think it's got like a liquid on the inside or something. Yeah, that's what it said. That's what you read, right? Yeah. Okay. Are they all one flavor? They're supposed to be strawberry. It looks like strawberry. Mm -hmm. Are they all strawberry? Yeah. Doesn't taste like strawberry. <laughs> Oh, it has another flavor, too. Mmm. Okay. All so, right. maybe the one I just had wasn't a strawberry. Because maybe. there's there other... Different flavors, yeah. Okay. Other flavors in here. Mmm. Okay. It's got a tart. Mm-hmm. Sweet tart. Mm-hmm. 
we're gonna go and stick with the Maynards. Something else that I know my sister loves. This is called Fuzzy Peach. She likes gummy stuff. I do like gummy stuff. Okay. That did not. <laughs> <laughs> that just any kind of gummy stuff. I love peaches. And this is supposed to be sweet and chewy peach flavored gummy slices packed with flavor and made with real fruit mm. juice. Okay, so there you go. I'm trying to get the other juicy squirt top. <laughs> hmm, these are kind of like sweet sour. Woo! Which I like. I like sweet and sour. Mmm. And the texture. Mmm. I like the texture of these. So it's a little bit better. Mm. Mm -hmm. These are pretty good, I think. They're very tart. You guys, they don't taste like any peach you've ever tasted. Mm. But if you like sweet and sour, it packs a nice punch. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, Thrill's Gum? Mm -hmm. Okay. Now we have Thrill's Gum. It still tastes like soap is a strange but endearingly Canadian description for this rose water flavored chewing gum. I, I'm gonna let my sister No, we're both we both have to try this. Because I was I was gonna leave this for like the last last <laughs> oh, I open that up for you, sis. Mm -hmm. there Thanks. You go. Okay, so show it. It's like a little chiclet. Yeah, it's purple. It's like a purple Can chiclet. You see it? Yeah. Let's see it better. Okay. Come on. Oh, wow. Okay. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. As soon as you bite down, you get that hint of soap. <laughs> it's not necessarily on your tongue, but until you keep chewing. But yeah. Okay. All right, very interesting. And I love the fact that they just go with it. They say, hey, it tastes like soap. <laughs> oh gosh. Yeah, it still tastes like soap. They haven't done anything to improve it. It still tastes like soap. Mm. All right, so I'm gonna get that out of my mouth. <laughs> Wow. Mm. I find it amazing. Yes. That there's a company selling a product. Yeah. That they know tastes like soap. Right. And other people know tastes like soap. But yet it's people still buying it. So I guess they're Because be I haven't something. eaten soap since I was a little kid. <laughs> but soap does it's better than that. It doesn't taste I mean it's it but it definitely has some hints. We're gonna look at these smarties. Yay, I love Smarties. Right, which these don't... A long-time favorite in Canada. These chocolate candies are covered in a brightly colored sugar coating. Yeah. Now, American versions of Smarties... Yeah, they're... they're have no taste. They do have a taste. There you go. Oh, these are different. Yeah, they kind of look like... I mean, they look like Smarties, but they kind of look like M&M's. Yeah, Smarties here are little circles. These are more flat discs. These are like... And they're they're like plain M and M's, but flatter. Yeah, mm. these are just like plain M and M's. Oh, they don't taste as good as M and M's. Mm mm. But they have a little bit of a soap taste. <laughs> well, okay. They just. All right. This says best ever. Mmm, chocolate covered raisins, I think. What does it say? Grab your favorite m movie and this favorite snack. Sweet raisins drenched in creamy milk chocolate. Okay. So you still have the candy in your mouth from the other way. So <laughs> I'm going to try these first. Okay. So they look just like um, 
Can you see that? They look just like raisinets. Hmm. You know, the chocolate tastes different. It's like a milder, it's, it's a milder version of a raisinette. It's, it's not as, as sweet. Which is probably a good thing. Because unlike the raisinettes, like with the raisinettes, you can only eat so many because it is sweet too. The chocolate is sweet. So this I think that you probably eat more of. Because it's kind of milder. That's just my opinion. She takes it forever. I mean, she's still eating of the. <laughs> she's a slow eater. This is why I guess she doesn't really like mukbangs either. Okay, next up. Ooh, Macintosh. Toffee. Macintosh. Hey, toffee. Enjoyed in Canada for over 100 years, Macintosh's toffee is known for being not too hard and not too soft. Ooh, yum. Creamy toffee. Wow, it's really like a top, like toffee. Oh. So it's going to be like toffee covered in something yeah. here I can show you how to break it okay go ahead Woo! okay <laughs> <laughs> that was good you have to crack it like that, that. was good that was good okay All okay right. so there's a piece let's try it okay nice flavor mm-hmm Mm -hmm. Just like when I was a kid, I haven't had candy like this since I was a little kid. Mm -hmm. But you know, it reminds me of a Heath bar. Mm -hmm. Of course, the Heath bar has chocolate and nuts over it, but it's the same type of center. Mm -hmm. Yummy. Maybe a sugar, sugar daddy, but harder. Mm -hmm. Caramel. Yeah. I'm sorry. Okay. Hmm. This is called wine gums. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, they don't even have that on this paper. Oh wow! So this is a surprise. Hmm. A surprise gift. Hmm. And it's taking me forever to be able to get this package open. Okay, so these are what gummies too. Mm. Okay. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Again, from Maynard's, they specialize by being gummies. I don't know what wine gums means. Hmm. Mm -hmm. I was going to say there's no flavor. This is the texture of dots. If you know the candy you get at the movies, dots. That's what this is like. And the flavor is like Nothing. almost non-existent. It's like mildly sweet rubber. Mm hmm Ugh. Uh-uh. I don't know if it's that. It has different colors. Yeah. Mm hmm But don't be fooled. There's neither wine <sighs> nor gum in here. Mm hmm All right. Is this the freshness date? The, you, this, well, the dates, they tell you that the dates are, <laughs> they do it differently. All right. So. Last but not least. Last but not least. Oh, Canada. The maple, maple lollipop. The maple This quintessentially lot of Canadian lollipop. treat is made of 100% pure maple syrup. What more could you ask for? Truly, I'll try that one, sis. Yeah, I'll let you go ahead and try that one. Because as you know, mm -hmm. I am a connoisseur right. of maple. Mm -hmm. 
Mm -hmm. And also, you're willing to let me do it because you see that we can't get it open. We can't. Oh, you just, yeah, I'm just going to say that's all you need to do. So. All the way down. Got it. Mm. Now this I could get behind. If this mm -hmm. tastes like authentic maple syrup, you might have me, Canada. Mm. Does it taste like maple syrup? Mm-mm. <laughs> what does it taste like? It tastes like sweet candy. Okay. Well, no is. maple flavor. Hmm, it says 100% maple. Mm-hmm. All right. Well, okay, enough. Okay, enough of the... All right, well, now is our time to actually rate um, this box. So, okay. For the different items. Okay, okay you guys, so we're going to rate everything in here. Um, let's taste each item, like, you know, let's taste and mm. then rate. Okay. Okay. So, mm. okay. Okay, so that was... The... So, I'm going to give you my feelings about the toffee. The I'm... Macintosh toffee. Would you say thumbs up or thumbs down? Well, I'm going to have to say, if I'm comparing it to a Heath bar, I'm going to be thumbs down. Okay. okay. I love toffee, and it tastes like toffee, so I'm happy. Okay. Okay. Glossette. <gasps> Chocolate covered raisins. Yeah. So I like them, so I'm going to say thumbs up. Okay. All right. And then we have the Smarties. Smarties. Canadian version. Yeah. I, it was okay. I don't really, I'm not really a big fan of the plain anyway. You didn't try the maple? No, but you said. But I did. And yeah. if it didn't taste like maple, then it's a thumbs down. <laughs> now, how about the flaky pastry? Oh, the flaky pastry. Which is all broken apart, so we can't, it's going to be hard. The flaky it. pastry, which was called yeah, the flaky. Passion Flaky. Yeah. Passion so, Flaky. I'm going to give a thumbs down. Okay. Um, we also had the Juicy Squirts. Love the name. Love the name? Okay. Yeah. Okay. All right. I'll be your Vanna White now. Next we have... Ruffles All Dressed. Eh. i give it a thumbs up. Yeah. Then, what about... How do you feel about the crush? Cream soda. Yeah. If I'm going to drink a soda... I want more from it from that. From, yeah, and the that. smell. Mm -mm. Yeah. Mm -mm. What about these um, wine gums? <laughs> <laughs> um, Ringolos. Ringolo Ringolos. Ringolos. I'm going to give a thumbs yeah, up. Yeah, I'd give them a thumbs up with a dip of something. Okay. Mm. Then we have the tasty tangy old, old Dutch, Dutch ketchup, ketchup flavored chips. chips. Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, ditto. <laughs> and I believe. Oh, uh, what about the thrills? I was the just going to say. So last but not least, we have. Da, 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 it still tastes like soap. <laughs> thrills gum. What do you think? First of all, I want to say it tastes exactly like what they say it's going to taste like. So that is a plus mm -hmm. as far as, you know, truth and advertising. But yeah, I don't care about them being truthful. Yeah. No. <laughs> all right. So thank you guys for joining us for our first uh, Snap Crepe review. Um, give us your feedback. Let us know if you like that, if you want to see more uh, different things like that. Um, we'd like to continue to do that. So please like, comment, and subscribe. Right, and don't forget to hit that notification bell so that you'll be made aware every time we upload a video. And check out our communities on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. All right. Thank you guys. Have a great day. Thanks. Bye.